Yes, the whole checkpoint also from Super Basket PR. I have uh, three main questions. Uh, yeah. Coach, it's extremely fun to watch your team on TV, and it's even much more fun to watch in person. Yeah. You played against team which is playing a slow pace usually and had very solid defense so far. What were the main factors that the game was on your team yeah. team terms? Yeah. We 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 know that. Uh, that uh, they they allowed uh, the opponents to shoot uh, a lot of threes. I think they are one of the best uh, defensive teams in the league for sure. But we wanted to take this as, as an advantage. So we have been working a lot on, on, on taking these shots, to don't be scared on these shots. I think uh, the players right now also, you know, because we are winning games, they are playing with a lot of confidence. And that makes us, you know, to start the game as we did. You know, we were taking um, maybe not the best shots, but you know, with confidence, everything is possible. So we live with that. We, me personally, as a coach, I have no problem to live with these shots. Uh, if uh, in the other side, in the other hand, we play good defense. So I think, uh, I think, on that way, we try to analyze them. As I said, uh, Adam and Duco are doing an amazing job, and they uh, show us the weakness. And, and, and we try to explode a lot on the pick and roll. They start switching on the on the off-ball screens. They probably were a little bit confused, and we still get the open shots. And uh, that makes us start you know, on fire, and, and the confidence uh, just uh, increase. Can you ask the second question? Uh, second question, uh, do you think your strength is your Played five games at home, one away. The away game was in Wrocław, probably the most difficult place to play in Poland. But, so I want, I want, I don't want to judge the result yeah. because it's, it's top level in Poland. Yeah, yeah. Do you think your team style can uh, transfer to the away games? Yeah, hundred percent. I think, uh, I think we are building our style, our identity, and that's uh, above everything. You know, I don't, I, we don't care where we play. Uh, we play, uh, you know, in, in this high level, and we 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 know, you know, what what we want to play, how we want to play. We trust in ourselves. We are not scared. Uh, we are really respectful uh, to the uh, opponents, especially when we play away, of course. Uh, but uh, I think we, this, we we showed also in Ambil, as you said, one of the toughest scored. Uh, we lost by six. We started the game pretty off. Uh, we have to get used to uh, trouble, you know, play away. Uh, but we came back and and we we tied the game at the end and uh, I, I hope we can uh, show and prove that we are competitive also away. You are, like, like I said, you know, 5-1 after pretty tough stretch of schedule because two finalists from last year also Ruby and Jiki mm -hmm. and uh, you got very good results. Is there any single element that you would prefer to still improve for your team? Uh, yeah, of course. I think uh, Defensively, I think we have a lot uh, to improve. Uh, I think uh, even though today, as I said, we did a step forward, you know, uh, but I think, of course, there are plenty of things, you know, transition defense, you know, I think it's one of the things like we have to improve. Uh, we are letting the other teams uh, score a lot from the free throw line. It's another thing that we have to evaluate, that we have to see. Uh, but yeah, uh, overall, I think uh, as I said, we are preparing the games pretty well. We, I'm so lucky to work with the best, uh, Adam and, and Duco, and uh, yeah, we have to keep improving for sure. Otherwise, we would not win games. Season is going to the higher and higher speed. Teams are looking on the market for new players. Bigger sharks are eating smaller fishes. Yeah. Uh, do you think you, you can, you as a coach and team? The way it functions now, it can go for the full season, or yeah. or it can be some you know website elements, agents yeah. looking, GMs, yeah. other teams looking. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I th I'm pretty uh, confident on that. Uh, all our players are under contract. Uh, there is no buyout for any of them. Uh, I know that they are happy uh, here. Uh, we are offering them, you know, a perfect uh, scenario, you know, to improve, to get better, to get exposure, and uh, hopefully, you know, they feel it like this and they want to finish with us. Uh, we are really satisfied with all of them. Of course, 5-1, you know, as you said, against top uh, teams in Poland. But we have to be ready because the losses will come, because we will play bad games, because we will struggle. And we have to be ready for these times because it will come. So uh, we have to stay humble and uh, keep working hard. That's what we are doing.
the last question. Uh, five, ten seconds after the game was over, you were talking to Komasiu and Wojciechowski, yeah. two of the youngest players. Yeah. You were, I, I hit it, hit it would be, could be a, a not correct word, but you were very persuasive in yeah. explaining yes. them something. Yeah. Can you share what you were telling them? I mean, what, what I, what I talked to... It was, it was, it was yeah. All the way over yes. the year, and yes. it was interesting to see that you, yes. you did some coaching yes. five, ten seconds after the yes. game was over. Yes, yeah, yeah. What, what I talk to them is between them and me. Uh, I, I hope you, you understand and you respect that. But uh, I think they are the two youngest uh, players we have. And I really wanted to, to, to make sure that they understand uh, what I thought about the last two, three minutes of the game. And uh, I think it was a perfect moment for them to really, you know, uh, get the feedback, you know. So I just came like this, you know, and, and I hope they, they understood and they took it well. Okay, thank you very much.